Welcome to our pick of the best headphones for audiophiles to buy. You won't just find the most powerful and expensive headphones for audiophiles in this video. We've also got headphones with amazing features and covering all kinds of budgets. This video will help you find out which headphones you need for audiophiles. All the headphones in this list have been thoroughly reviewed by us, and only the best are included in this video. Let's start. If you're really set on owning the absolute best headphones the money can buy, we advise spending your cash on the WH-1000X. Not only are Sony's flagship headphones a top noise-canceling model at the moment, but they outperform every competitor in numerous categories, including sound and special features. The company's loud and dynamic soundstage delivers plenty of boom and detail to give songs full-bodied presence. Listeners can also play around with the Sony Headphones Connect app to personalize audio by selecting from several well-engineered presets, or by manually adjusting the EQ to their liking. The WH-1000XM4's active noise cancellation is right up there with the Bose 700s and the touch controls and battery life, 30 hours with ANC on our superior. Not much has changed in terms of design, but the premium craftsmanship certainly gives these cans a luxe look that match their high price. Next one is Bose 700. The Bose 700 are the runner-up for best headphones and have a sexy new design and cool features that come with its high price tag. They're equipped with a whopping eight microphones six of which are employed to deliver Bose's champion noise cancellation when listening to music or talking on the phone. With the run, it offers up to 11 levels of adjustable ANC that work equally well to neutralize noise across different frequencies. Bose even made improvements to sound quality, as the 700s produce clean, balanced audio for crisp highs and solid bass. Lows are felt more when at maximum ANC level. Despite sharing the same battery life as its predecessor, the QC35 Roman II it still holds up strong at 20 hours with a smart assistant integration, touch controls, and improved multipoint technology also make these some of the most intuitive noise cancelers for commuters and music lovers alike. On number third is AirPods Max. It's a shame the AirPods Max are so much more expensive than their noise cancelling rivals, but once you try them it's hard to take them off. The plush design and comfortable fit present an immediate feeling of luxury, and this only grows once you start playing music. The active noise cancelling works brilliantly, general sound quality is crisp and impactful, and the 3D spatial audio feature is a game changer if you've never used it. This uses head tracking tech to create a surround sound effect, which can give movie playback a definite edge compared to other headphones. Battery life is respectable too, with Apple's 20-hour estimate tracking well with our own testing. Number fourth is Jabra. Jabra found a way to improve our favorite wireless earbuds packing a hell of a lot of performance into a tinier waterproof design. The Elite Active 75 it boasts better battery life and sound than the AirPods Pro. Plus a charging case holds more portable power and feels sturdier. Fitness fanatics will love the reliable comfort and fit they provide. Sweat absorption is one of many unsung features on here. Any areas where the Elite 75 it fell short like call quality and digital assistant support have been improved as well. The buds produce consistently clean detail and warm lively instrumentals, and vocals that can also be tweaked through special features, for example built-in EQ, music presets and the companion app for personalized sound. Best of all, the new over-the-air NC update brings active noise cancellation to the earbuds and does a surprisingly good job of blocking out ambient sound. Keep in mind that even with ANC turned off, the Elite Active 75 it offers amazing passive noise cancellation. If you wanted grander noise cancelling results, we do recommend the all-new Elite 85 it which boasts its own ANC chip and delivers great noise neutralization and sound. On the number 5 are the Apple AirPods Pro. A year on store shelves and Apple's noise-canceling earbuds are still arguably the top model in their class. The level of engineering demonstrated on the AirPods Pro cannot be overstated. Underneath the smaller, redesigned casing are six sensors, a powerful 3 mic array, and Apple's renowned H1 chip that boosts performance on all fronts. Audio is significantly improved from the AirPods 2 with the buds producing clean, balanced sound to enjoy music, podcasts, and movies peacefully. Adding to its sonic capabilities are new features like spatial audio that were introduced with iOS 14 and create a theater-like soundscape that makes watching movies even more immersive. ANC is also surprisingly effective, as the outward and inward-facing mics manage to neutralize a large amount of ambient sound. Low humming noises and neighborly chatter will go completely silent. The inclusion of ear tips makes a world of difference, insulating sound, while providing a comfy and customized fit, which can also be optimized for better audio output through the all-new ear tip fit test. Hands-free Siri just keeps getting better and better, while cool features like announced messages, audio sharing, 
and auto-switching showcase the AirPods Pro's multifunctional talents. The new AirPods 3 also gets some of these features, including spatial audio, announced messages, and adaptive EQ, plus MagSafe charging, a water and sweat-resistant design, and 6-hour battery life. But the AirPods Pro still has ANC in its favor. On number 6 is Bowers and Wilkins PX7. If you're looking for wireless headphones with active noise cancellation and you're not put off by the $300 or $600 price tag, the Bowers and Wilkins PX7 wireless headphones are well worth considering. The title of best wireless headphones still goes to the Sony WH-1000XM4 of course, but there's not much in it between Sony's cans and these from Bowers and Wilkins. With sophisticated noise cancellation, much improved sound quality, and a hone aesthetic. We found the PX7 a delight to test and think they could give any of the headphones on this list a run for their money. Plus, their packing app X adaptive for improved stability and latency between the headphones and your device, as well as high quality 24 bit streaming app X HD brought to the table. That's why they are the best headphones if you're looking for a strong pair of all rounders. Seventh number is Plantronics Backbeat Go 810. For years, the Plantronics Backbeat Pro 2 were among our favorite wireless headphones because of their excellent sound, build quality, and features. Unfortunately, they were also kind of expensive. These over-ear headphones use less premium materials, but during our testing we found the sound nearly identical to its more expensive predecessor, and these headphones sport an equally chic design. With that in mind, the Backbeat Go 810 are the best headphones for those that want wireless connectivity without the high price tag. On number 8 are Neuraloop headphones. Neuraloop has boiled down the essence of the company's first product, the Neurophone, into a much more compact, rugged, and affordable package, and doesn't lose much in the process with the Neuraloop headphones. When we reviewed these headphones, we found the star of the show to be the adaptive audio technology, which automatically determines a customized listening profile and feeds you well balanced, less sound tailored to you as a result. Although that's the USB of these earbuds. There are plenty of other features that make the Neuraloop headphones stand out, including active noise cancelling, social mode, an IPX3 rating, immersion mode, a great battery life, and the ability to attach an analog cable for 3.5M headphone jacks. Next one on number 9 is AKG N6. It's also the great choice. The price of these headphones has fallen considerably. They're an even better buy. The noise cancellation is very good, and like other KG headphones there's good, solid bass without overpowering the mid-range and treble. They're comfortable, too, which is an important consideration if you're using them on your travels. The battery is decent for cheap noise-canceling headphones, with 15 hours of playback over Bluetooth. If you just want full noise cancellation, you're good for a whopping 30 hours of peace and relative quiet before you need to find a charger. Last one in our list is Sony WHCH. Looking at the Sony WHCH 510, it's mind-blowing that wireless on your headphones could cost this little, not to mention a pair that has decent sound, a USB-C port, and 35 hours of battery life. If you're looking for headphones at this price point, you're likely already willing to make a few sacrifices. Thankfully, most of the compromises Sony has made with the WHCH510 haven't been too crucial. The lack of analog input mirrors the loss of the 3.5M port on most modern smartphones while the lightweight. Plastic construction improves their portability and comfort. While they won't have the superb clarity, balance, and sense of space that their WH-1000XM4 siblings boast, the sound these on-ear headphones produce definitely belies their size and price. You'll find most genres perform well here, although tracks that already have low mids and bump treble might get uncomfortably exaggerated. Do you agree with these recommendations? Leave your opinion in comments below. Don't forget to subscribe the channel and like the video. Thanks for watching.